Understanding Water ORP, Importance and Effects in RO Plants Welcome to our video on Water ORP and its significance in RO plants. Today, we will explore the vital role of ORP, oxidation reduction potential, in the reverse osmosis RO, process and how it impacts water quality. What is ORP? ORP, or oxidation reduction potential, measures the water's ability to undergo oxidation or reduction reactions. It indicates the water's potential to either accept or donate electrons, which can affect its overall quality. Importance of ORP in RO plants In an RO plant, maintaining the right ORP level is crucial. Proper ORP helps ensure the efficient removal of contaminants like bacteria, viruses, and organic matter during the filtration process. Effect on water quality. High ORP levels indicate the presence of strong oxidizing agents, which can help in disinfection. On the other hand, low ORP levels might indicate the presence of reducing agents, which can cause taste and odor issues. Optimal ORP range. The ideal ORP range for RO water is typically between plus 150 to plus 300 MV, which ensures effective disinfection and minimizes fouling in the RO membrane. Monitoring and adjusting ORP. To maintain the optimal ORP range, RO plants use ORP sensors that constantly monitor the water quality. If ORP deviates from the desired range, Adjustments can be made to ensure proper water treatment. Conclusion Water ORP plays a vital role in RO plants, influencing water quality and treatment effectiveness. By understanding and managing ORP levels, RO plants can provide safe and clean drinking water to communities. We hope you found this video informative. If you have any questions or suggestions, feel free to leave a comment below. Thank you for watching, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more educational content.